Hello everyone, welcome back to the Math Puzzle Crash Course. We've got a, a small puzzle here. Uh, it has to do with ages between a father and a daughter. And so uh, let's get right into this one. So um, a father is four times the age of his daughter. In 20 years, he will be twice her age. How old in years are they now? So kind of an interesting problem. Um, it's a perfect application for algebra. And uh, if you want to, you could pause the video here and we'll work this out together. Um, you may have been able to figure it out in your head, but um, we will we'll, we'll work through this one together. It's a good word problem, a good application for some algebra here. So uh, we will work it out. All right, so <clears throat> we could set a variable here to uh, represent the daughter's age today. Uh, we'll just use X. We could have used any letter we wanted, but we'll use X and say X represents the daughter's age today. Uh, and we know that the father is four times as old as the daughter today, so the father would be 4X. <clears throat> so X just represents a variable. If uh, the daughter was one year old, the father would be four years old. Of course, that doesn't make any biological sense whatsoever, but... You know, if X was um, 50, uh, the father would be 200. Again, that seems a little unrealistic as far as, you know, life expectancy. But basically, that's all it is. We don't really know how old the daughter, how old the daughter is. We don't know how old the father is for sure. We just know that relationship, that the daughter is X years old, the father is 4X years old. Um, the other part of the problem we've got, the other information we've got, is that in 20 years, the daughter will be X plus 20 because you're basically going to add 20 more years to her current age, whatever it is. And then the father is going to be 4X plus 20. Uh, be, and because we know the daughter is X, the father is 4X currently, we just add 20 to both of those. Uh, and that relationship, um, you know, will be the same. Um, we do we do know though that in 20 years the um, father will be twice as old as the daughter. So if we wanted to make an equation out of this, we would uh, multiply the daughter's age by two. In 20 years, we would multiply the daughter's age by two, which would then equal the father's age in 20 years. So if we say the father will be 4x plus 20 years old, 20 years from now. Uh, and we multiply the daughter's age 20 years from now by 2, well, that sets up an equation that we can solve. We can actually then solve for x. So we have 2 times the quantity x plus 20 equals 4x plus 20. Um, if you multiply this out, you're left with 2x plus 40 equals 4x plus 20. All right, so again, um, we can simplify this a little bit. We want to try to isolate the x. So you can um, subtract 20 from both sides of the equation. We want to get rid of this 20. We want to eventually just end up with x here. So if you subtract 20 from both sides of this, um, you're going to end up uh, basically here with uh, 2x plus 20 on the left side because 40 minus 20 is 20 and then on this right side um, 20 minus 20 is 0 4x plus 20 minus 20 would leave us with just the 4x over here on the right so 2x plus 20 equals 4x so we can <clears throat> further simplify that by subtracting 2x from both sides 2x minus 2x plus 20 equals 4x minus 2x and what does that leave us with? Well, it just leaves us here with 20 equals 2x. Well, if you divide both sides by 2, you're going to end up with uh, x equals 10, which tells us, we remember we said that x is the daughter's age today, so x equals 10, that would be the daughter's age. So if x equals 10, the daughter's 10, the father would be 40. And why would that be? Because we said today the father's four times as old as his daughter. So in 20 years, that's pretty simple. You just add 20 to both of those ages. That would make the daughter 30 and the father 60. And, and that follows because 60 will be twice the age of 30. 
Um, so yeah, you go back and look at the, the original problem. The father is four times the age of his daughter, so that makes him currently 40. It makes her currently 10. Um, and yeah, in 20 years, he'll be twice her age, so that would make 60 and 30 be the ages, which, which makes sense. 60 divided by 30 is 2, so he'd be twice as old. So, um, so hopefully this has been helpful as a, as a good example, and um, I look forward to seeing everybody in the next video.